and rendezvous with the fleet, sir. He gave coordinates. But he didn't say immediately. All right, who's got ideas? Diversionary tactics. We'll do boxed in. Vent the nacelles, create a cloud? We need to be able to see. Jam their comms so they can't coordinate attacks. That's it. That's the one. Need go and use life for ship-to-ship -ship messaging. I'm modulating the deflector array to emit a spectrum. Should confuse them for a bit. All right, now, how do we beam our people back to Enterprise? Scans indicate the Gorn ships are transport resistant. Even if we get past the shields, we need authorization codes. No time to hack codes. Retreat and rescue. It's the best of a bunch of bad options. So how do we track this specific ship across light years of space? Walkite, a rare element that contains subspace gauge bosons. If we modified a homing beacon, the Gorn would see a beacon coming from a mile away. Not if it's a torpedo. We tag him with a dud. The Gorn won't know what we're up to. at 30%. For this to succeed, we still need to penetrate the Gorn's defensive systems. We've been hitting them with everything we've got. It doesn't do much. Uh, energy shields work on harmonics. If we find the right frequency, we can ram the ship. Indeed. When our shields make contact with theirs, they will create a destructive interference pattern and momentarily interrupt both frequencies. With our shields down, we'd be sitting ducks. We'd only have one shot. That's all we need. Mitchell, bring us around. Head to head with the destroyer. Time to play a game of chicken. All decks prepare for impact. Full impulse on your orders, Captain. Inertial dampeners to maximum. Everybody hold on to something. Una. Let's hit it. Out of here. On it. Hang on. 